Alberta's physicians and pharmacists can now use a new iPhone application to help them better manage medications and their side effects for the 80,000 Albertans who suffer from heart failure. We have a uh, heart failure medication titration app now on the iPhone which enables clinicians to manage complicated medications uh, very easily and with quick reference which is convenient. This tremendously simplifies and speeds up the process of care for patients with heart failure. Designed by Alberta Health Services in collaboration with the University of Alberta, MedHF provides interactive step-by-step -step instructions to help determine the appropriate dosage of a medication and to monitor and manage any side effects. You input what your situation is and the app comes up with a recommendation for you, to, uh, your next action. It's actually a very useful, portable, accessible tool for me to check on medication doses in particular with my patients with heart failure because there are a lot of medications that they're on and uh, it gets complicated managing these medications along with other conditions that people have like diabetes and blood pressure issues and things. So it's just a, it's a resource for me to, to constantly check uh, myself. Heart failure is the inability of the heart to pump enough blood to meet the body's needs. Drug interactions with other medications or conditions such as diabetes can have serious side effects including irregular heart rhythm and reduced kidney function. The new app provides a reliable and readily available reference tool to help care for heart failure patients. The average heart failure patient is on 10 to 12 medications. So it's quite complicated and they all interact with each other in many instances. So you want to ensure that uh, when you uh, are changing these powerful medications that you don't overlook a potential side effect or problem uh, that you should check for. Uh, one of the challenges for us is to get everybody up to the proper recommended target dose that they can tolerate that's recommended by the guidelines for heart failure. And this application has all those target doses for me because it's pretty hard to memorize all of that all the time. That's good news for Doreen Kirby, who credits her family doctor for using the app to help manage her care. I think that's good because they're so busy and I think they can see more patients or take care of more patients with something like that using the right medications and like Dr. Forsyth just changed one of mine and I take two which is the maximum dose and I take it now at night instead of the morning so I think you know while you sleep it gets absorbed better and probably works better. This app was developed, uh, it, it was conceived in the, uh, in, 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 uh, at the University of Alberta. It was developed in conjunction with the University of Calgary, but also with uh, literally thousands of stakeholders across the country. Now the app is supported and promoted by the Canadian Cardiovascular Society, which is a national organization. The AHS Cardiovascular Health and Stroke Strategic Clinical Network is a province-wide team of healthcare professionals, researchers, community leaders and policymakers working to enhance the patient experience and improve outcomes across the province. MedHF, the province's first mobile app for clinicians, is one example of how the SCN is improving heart and stroke care throughout Alberta.